something weak position on his bike would probably look like Alright, let's go down. There's some heat over there. Get some sun. Back to the daily grind and shout out to the full time patrons. Make sure to hit subscribe if you're new and hit thumbs up if you're not a baby back bagel biting bitch boy because you know what time it is. It's full time. MMA. And it's your boy Taco Bell Wani and I have to make this quick full time family because I have to get to work. But with that being said, I got to catch you up on what happened after the Felding Charles Bennett fight last night at Cam Soda's Legends where he lost to Bruce Lutch Medio. That was the fight and you know a lot of us on the channel were waiting for a good fight, fun fight. Um, but afterwards, I hear the announcer saying Colby Covington's going to be in the crowd. Mike Perry's going to be in the crowd. There was a lot of American top team guys in the crowd because this event took place in Florida. I think in all five fights, there was an American top team fighter or all six fights. So this was a really American top uh, team event, which makes sense why Colby Covington, who's from American Top Team, would have these same girls in his video where he says, oh, only 7.5s are better, I'm with a different girl every night. Turns out it's actually just paid porn star actresses who were paid to be in that video with him. These same porn star actresses were also at Cam Soda's Legends last night. Um, you can clearly, we did a video where we talked about Colby Covington's Queens of Chaos were actually just adult actresses. One of them was Kelsey Monroe and the other one, we got her name as well. Um, she was also working the Cam Soda Legends card, which we wouldn't have probably found that out if we weren't watching the felony Charles Bennett fight. Either way, Colby Covington's Queens of Chaos, I think this might have been what sparked this little altercation we saw between felony Charles Bennett and Chaos Covington. But Colby Covington was like, yo, you think you can take pictures with my girl? That's my girl. And he's like, Charles Bennett was like, no, nah, that's everybody's girl, bro. Have you not been to Black Dot? No, I'm just playing. I'm just kidding. It, it wasn't over Kelsey Monroe. It was just an interesting, fun fact that Kelsey Monroe happened to be the adult actress in Colby Covington's video and then also in Felony Charles Bennett's video. So, you know, motherfuckers are always fighting over girls, but that wasn't the case here, even though she was common. What happened here was, if you recall, Colby Covington went at Mike Perry a while back and called his girlfriend a horse face and said he came from Ocala, Florida, the home of the cousin fuckers. Well, felony Charles Bennett just so happens to be from Ocala, Florida. So every time he would hear Colby Covington talking about Ocala, Florida, he, like a lot of other people, took it upon themselves to fucking not like Colby Covington. Like, fuck that Colby Covington. He always calls him Cole Ho and, you know, he talking about Ocala, Florida. And, you know, Colby Covington, that's what he's doing. He's trying to piss everybody off. Well, it worked on felony Charles Bennett. So when they saw each other at the Cam Soda's Legends card, of course, felony Charles Bennett said something to him. You know, hey, something about Ocala, Florida, I'm assuming Colby Covington, you think he's about to back down from 145 pound felony Charles Bennett, Colby Covington, the welterweight wrestling powerhouse. You think he's about to fucking back down from Colby Covington when all of his teammates are around? the yeah, all of American top team. Colby Covington's the bigger guy. So Charles Bennett was outsized and outnumbered, but he still took it upon himself to approach Colby Covington. Kobe Covington gave him a little shove, a little shove. Felony Charles Bennett came back with one punch, and that's really all there was. But at the same time, we seen Kobe Covington press charges before for something little. We saw him throw the boomer Fabricio through the boomerang, and Kobe said, "I had to press charges." Bada boom, bada bang. It's because I needed the video. If I wanted the video, I had to press charges. Well, this video someone recorded on a cell phone, so that's not going to be a good excuse. We'll see if Kobe Covington presses charges on felony Charles Bennett. It's very likely. I mean, he got touched, and we know how Kobe acts when he gets touched. Bleep. All right, with that being said, Kobe Covington um, got into a little scuffle with felony Charles Bennett at the Cam Soda Legends after felony Charles Bennett's fight last night. And, you know, just a little bit of a scuffle. With that being said, I'll keep you guys updated whenever I hear if Kobe's pressing charges or if everything's just chilled out either way with that being said it is what it is i might be able to make one or two more videos before it work let the full-time family know what you think in the comments i'm out and as always thanks for watching this video if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell right next to it so you're notified every time i upload a video i'm out this is number one bullshit